Hey, I know there's been so many requests for Motionless and White, but I had to go with Another Life first. I saw a lot of people saying this was a sequel or something to Eternally Yours, or it was next in line. I'm not really sure, so don't worry. We're going to get to the other ones. I just felt like this one was fitting. We go with this one next. And, of course, there's a video here for us to check out. Um, their videos have been hit or miss with getting blocked, so it may or may not be blurred. You guys know the, the, the drill already. It's the, the crap I deal with. But, uh, hey, I'm here for the music at the end of the day, and everything that I've heard so far by this band has been crazy awesome, so I'm super excited. Uh, let's just get right into it. If I can't let you go, will darkness divide? For the fiction of love is the truth of oh. our lies. We were playing for keeps, but we both knew the cost. Wow. Now the only way out in your heart shaped box. But I hate. Okay, so this is going to be uh, an emotional one. This is a deep one. I like that. But man, we can't pat we, we can't skip over the vocals. The clean vocals are so good. And you can really feel I mean already the emotion, the pain in here. This is awesome. Big bass here. This, this is a heartbreak story is what uh, what I'm getting from it anyways. It's freaking sad, but this sounds amazing. I, his voice is so good. We're definitely getting more of the emotional singing style here than the, the intensity, but I don't know. They might they might flip it here. We're, we're only halfway through. They might flip it and do something crazy. Top one. Drums and bass are so big. <laughs> okay. You could feel that one. <laughs> that, there was a lot of pain and emotion in there. That, oh 
man. That was nice. I liked it. That was Motionless and White, Another Life. There wasn't really anything too crazy here on that this song. It was pretty pretty straightforward, like, instrument-wise. I mean, they didn't do anything really out there. Um, it was really heavily focused on, like, the chorus, and it was just a really uh, good song to listen to. I mean, it was really emotional, really emotional. There was a lot of pain in here, but it was one of those songs that was just... It was just a, a good, easy one to listen to. It was kind of catchy um, and just not a whole lot of crazy stuff going on, but it just sounded really, really nice. And of course, I mean, his vocals are amazing. We did get a little bit of intensity in here, but it was really more centered on the, the pain, emotion, sadness kind of side. And, you know, I, I appreciate that too. I think it still sounded amazing. And, uh, you know, this, ba <laughs> this band, I they have not disappointed in the slightest yet in the slightest so i am super excited to keep going um so many more to check out so many recommendations so don't worry we're get we're gonna get through them we're gonna get through them so stick around guys and as always if you're still here if you're still watching thank you so much and i will see you on the next one